What if you could treat hair loss effectively but with a lower risk of side effects. Now, finasteride works by reducing DHT, the hormone responsible for hair thinning in androgenetic alopecia. But an important point often gets missed. DHT is not inherently harmful. The goal isn't to eliminate it completely, but only to reduce it below a threshold. That's why oral finasteride has strong evidence behind it. At one year, the majority of patients experience stabilization. However, systemic exposure can lead to side effects in some individuals. This is where topical finasteride becomes clinically relevant. Applied directly to the scalp, it targets the hair follicle locally with reduced systemic absorption. The result? Comparable efficacy in selected cases with little to no side effect profile. Is it appropriate for everyone? No. Patients with aggressive hair loss may still require oral therapy. But for those who cannot tolerate oral finasteride, the topical version offers an excellent evidence-based alternative. The key is individualized treatment guided by your prescribing physician. Dive deeper into the oral versus topical finasteride comparison with the video linked below.